Hello, first graders. Welcome back to SIF's Lesson 12. It's Mrs. Grisson. Let's get started. All right, we are going to be listening for the last sound, the sound at the end. So I'm going to say these. Sound these. Ease these sound these very good say rude sound rude 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 last sound D. very good say wake sound a k wake last sound k very good <clears throat> excuse me say while sound w i o while sound u very good say choose sound Ooze. Sound. Very good. And our last one, say wide. Sound. W I D. Wide. Last sound. D. Very good. All right. Next, I am going to tell you the name of a sound, and then you're going to tell me what that sound is. So, for example, I'm going to say long E, and you're going to say E. Very good. So let's get started. I'm going to say long O. Long O, you say O. Very good. How about short I? Short I. And if you're in my class, we know that's over here. Yeah. Very good. If right here. How about long A? Long A. Get this one right here and to be over here. Long A says A. Very good. Short U. Short U. The kitty cat under the chair. Short U says under. And our last one, long E. Long E says E. It says its name. Long vowels say their names. Short vowels are our at the chair cards right up here. All right. We have a sound today that we're going to be talking about. He yelled as he jumped and landed. You guessed it. E-D. And E-D has three sounds. The first sound says T. Jumped. T. The second sound is d. Yelled. Yelled. And the third sound is ed. Land. Ed. Landed. Ed has three sounds. Take a peek right here. And our sounds. We have the word like. We have liked. Liked. That makes the t sound. T. Like and liked. You also might notice that the E 
goes bye-bye and they add the ed for this. So let's look here. We have name, named. So again, they drop the e from name and they add ed, named. That's making the d sound. We have the t, d. And how about this last one? Hate. I hate the cold. So here we have hate, did, ed, the third sound for ed. Again, they dropped the e and they added ed. Hate, ed. Liked, named, and hated. The three sounds that ed makes. Let's go through our other sounds that we have so far. We have inflectional ending, ing, ing. He is smiling, ing. Inflectional ending, s, with two sounds. First one says, s, as in taps. Second sound is, z, as in runs. ES, inflectional ending ES, says as, pass as, buzzes. SP, sp, SK, sk, CL, cl, SL, sl. Here we have our E, U with our two sounds. We can take a peek up here. We have mule and oo, like hoot. Two sounds with our long vowel U. Long vowel O. Right here, B, own. The O says its name. Long vowel E. Right here, tr e says its name. Long vowel i, k, i t says its name, and long vowel a, k, a k. Again, it says its name. Long vowels say their names. Let's go through our mixed list. All right, we have, let's see if you can see this a little better. Runs, runs. Here we have our ED. Saved, saved. K, it, kit. G, aims, games. This one, I want to talk about it for a minute. If I cover the S, I see that I have an E at the end. And that E is going to tell me G A. The A says its name. G Ames. And the S at the end. I like to play games. Here's smiling. Smiling. And here I want us to look at our rule that we talked about last week. And we can count how many vowels do I have, or how many consonants do I have in between my vowels? I have one. One consonant. So one consonant tells me that that vowel is going to be long. Smiling. D O Z ing. D O Z ing. This is following that same rule. There's one consonant right here in between two vowels. St. We have this blend that we know. St. Have that silent E at the end, jumping over. St. Owns. Stones. W. Ave. In. Waving. Again, we have a consonant in between one consonant in between two vowels. So that means that that vowel is going to be a long vowel.
I'm going to cover that ED. It's going to make it easier for me to read this word. Miss, mist, mist. Ruled, ruled. Track, track. Huh. All, whole. Find, find. K, I, t. Got silent E right here is jumping over time the I to say its name. I have it circled so we can recognize. Oh, there's a silent E. Ache, een, faking, and per eyes, prizes. Our last page here we have v oted, voted. Again, one consonant in between two vowels, so we know it's going to make the long vowel sound. Sp o k spoke. Silent E jumping over, telling the O to say its name. Ch. You know that sound. Ch. Ch. A. Chased. Robs. Robs. And str str Ike. Ing. Striking. And tr. Aid. Ed. Trade. Ed. Trade. Ed. All right. Our new vocabulary, or not vocabulary, I'm sorry, our new sight words. The apple tasted good. The apple tasted good. Our first word is g -ud, good. Let's go ahead and spell. Ready? G. O O D. Read. Good. Spell. Read. Good. Spell. Read. Good. Nice. Our next word. Most. Most summer days are warm. The word is most. We have that ST, that consonant blend at the end here instead of at the beginning. M O, our long O sound right here. M O St. Most. Let's spell that. M O. S T read spell read spell read most very good and our last word it's a tricky one I think you guys are gonna know this though we will read a story. We will read a story. Yesterday, we read a story too. Our word is read and read. Let's go ahead and spell R E. A D. Read, read, spell. Spell. Read, read. Very good. Go ahead and take a peek at the sight words you've been working on. We have won't. 
W O N apostrophe T. Won't. I won't do that. Won't. And D don't. Don't. D O N apostrophe T. Don't. Were. Where were you? Were. W E R E. Were. Watch. Spell W A T C H. Watch. And we can take a peek over here. Let's see if you guys can see this. Our CH card. When we have a CH and a TCH, they make the same sound. So we can look at our card if we're not quite sure. Watch. Full. Very good. Pull. School. S C H O O L. School. I miss being at school. Ch. Ch. Children. Children. Friend. Can we work with your body? F R I E N D. Friend. Wild. Wild. Child. We have a ch sound. Could. Would. Carry, not going to spell that one, again, and both. Nice. Good job with that review. Okay, now it's time for us to do our writing. So I hope you have your paper. If not, go ahead and pause me while you run and get that. I will get to our words. Alrighty, we can get started on our dictation. Our first word, say pave. Pave. They will pave the streets. So that first sound that we hear is a p, p. A, over here. A, it's the first spelling. Long A. P A V V V, and we know there's a silent e at the end, making the a say its name. P A P A V E. Our next word is tw twin. Say twin. Hear that sound? Twin. T T T. T. W W W. W, and here's an easy one, N, I, N, twin. Number three, name. We've been doing that one for a while. Say name, sound name, N, A, First A sound right here. You can see that. A, M, mm. and again we know that there's a silent E at the end. Name N A M E. Name. Right. Number four. Higher. H. Higher. So we hear that H at the beginning. Write our H. I, we're going to look over here for the first spelling, the long I sound. I, er, with our silent E at the end. Higher, higher. All right, number five, many. 
many. I have many birds flying over my house. Many. Mm. An, a, n, ma, an, an, e. That's a tricky one. Sounds like it's saying the long e, right? When there's a y at the end, it can say e or i. Man, e. So don't let that trick you. That's a y at the end. M, a, n, y. Okay, our next word say over. Over. She jumped over the log. So O. And we're gonna use this first spelling right up here in our long O. O V V V V O V R Over E R the end O V R over. Okay, and here comes our sentence. It says, did the dog hide? Did the dog hide? Let's start with our first one. D, d. Don't forget to make that D a capital. D, I, and D. Did. D, I, D. Make sure that second D goes the right way. Sometimes we get confused with the B. D, id, the, T, H, E. Some of you probably were able to write that one on your own. Did, the, dog, D, D. Another D, again, make sure it's going the right way. D, ah. And we have our short vowel O there, d a g the G at the end, og. Did the dog hide? H I our first spelling, the long vowel I sound right here. Ha I d and then we know we need that silent E at the end. With our end punctuation. This is an asking sentence, boys and girls. Did the dog hide? So we're going to put a question mark for our end punctuation here. Did the dog hide? And if you got all those, give yourself a big smiley face. If yours look just like mine, Remember, with our capital and our in punctuation of the question mark. And there we go. Thank you, boys and girls, for joining me for Lesson 12. I will see you in a few days for Lesson 14. Thank you. Bye-bye.